Welcome, Bet Riders, to the Bet Expo. My name is Gary Solomon, and I'm the host of the Laid Back Bike Report. With me today is Marshall from Terratrike. Hello, Marshall. Hello, Gary. Thanks for inviting us to be part of the uh, Bent Expo. We are excited to have you here and talking about uh, Terratrike. So why don't you go ahead and uh, tell us a little bit about what's going on at Terratrike and what you have uh, in store for us today. Sure. I think what I want to lead with, uh, Gary, is just that uh, for those not familiar with Terratrike, uh, Terratrike is part of the uh, Wizwheel family, which now includes uh, Green Speed uh, Trike. So one thing I'll throw at the front end and probably again at the back end is, yeah, make sure to check out the Green Speed uh, video as well. But uh, to tell you a little bit about Terratrike, it was uh, founded in 1996 uh, by Jack Wiswell and Wayne Ohm. And uh, that mention of 1996 is uh, not by accident. Uh, for those quick like you, Gary, you'll quickly get to, yeah, next year is our 25th anniversary. So uh, some of the things we're going to be doing next year, I can talk about. And some of those things uh, I can't talk about. But uh, to be sure, we'll be coming out with some special badging on the trikes and some special uh, uh, products and some really cool events. And we're pretty excited about that. And uh, kind of speaking of colors, uh, one of the other things we're going to do, Gary, is uh, we're going to introduce a lot of new colors uh, for 2021. Um, I'll leave that as a little bit of a surprise as they come out. All right, Marshall, that's, uh, that's, a, that's a great rundown of what we got coming up. Now, uh, I know you're going to be talking about uh, various categories uh, of trikes at, at Terra Trike. We're going to kind of organize it in that manner. Can you tell us a little bit about how we're going to do this? Yeah, sure. Um, one of the things, uh, Gary, is we certainly understand that people purchase trikes and use them for a lot of different things, regardless of what the uh, design intent may have been. But we really like to break our product down into categories and design to that category. And for us, we've got leisure, folding, electric, tandem, adventure tour, and performance is, is our main uh, categories. And if you will, you know, I'm, I'm going to jump right into it. So leading that off is that leisure category. And, you know, for us, leisure category could also be kind of called the comfort category. It's kind of what you get out and just kind of ride around doing and not overly stressing your body or being concerned with how fast you get there, or maybe even how far you're going to go. It is really kind of that almost rolling lawn chair type of approach to the category. So leisure category, what do you have in the lineup that fits the bill for that, Marshall? Yeah, the first strike in that category is the Maverick. And the Maverick has been in the line now uh, for a year. And man, it has turned out to be one of our most popular uh, trikes. It's an externally geared trike uh, featuring an eight speed uh, drivetrain. And then, you know, so I'll say we've got three trikes in the that uh, category. And the next one is going to be kind of exciting because it's a new trike for 2021. Um, it should be coming out the latter part of this year. And that's going to be the Rogue. And it shares most of the components of the Maverick, except that it features the new Enviolo uh, City drivetrain, which for those that aren't familiar with Enviolo, it's a stepless system that you can shift while at a complete stop or you can shift while under a complete load. It's the most simple of the drivetrains out there right now. And I think for that reason, it really fits well in that leisure category. The last in the leisure category is the Rambler. Uh, the Rambler has received a number of significant updates in 2020. And those updates has caused it to be our most popular trike. They're selling as quickly as we can get them in. The Rambler now has a wider uh, stance, wider wheelbase. And we did that to give it a little bit more stability and to give us a little bit more room to prevent heel rub. Uh, it features a, a nine speed drivetrain, those 24 inch wheels on all four corners. And that gives it also a little bit higher uh, seat position to help people with getting in and out of the trike. Um, it comes in solar yellow and the price on that trike is 1799. 
And Gary, to round off the other ones, uh, the Maverick was uh, eleven ninety nine, and the new Rogue is going to come in at fifteen ninety nine. And I guess I should also lastly mention is that that Rambler also has a weight limit of uh, 450 pounds. And that rounds out that leisure category. Let's move along from leisure to uh, something that's going to make it easier for folks to uh, transport these trikes, and that's the folding mechanism. So what do you got in, the, in terms of folding trikes? Sure. So in folding trikes, um, we have the Traveler. Uh, that is our only folding trike in the lineup. Um, you know, I, I think we just have to have that one trike that makes it easier for people that have, you know, either storage issues or they have, you know, the smallest of small cars and that sort of thing. So we're happy to have that traveler in our lineup. Again, it's a trike that's been there for a number of years and every year it kind of like moves along and gets another little update. The latest of the updates for the traveler is it's now a single flat folding trike which enables that rear wheel to just nest really nice between uh, the front wheels. But I would also add the front wheels on the Traveler have the rapid axles on it, which most of our trikes now have, which make it real easy to remove uh, the front wheels. So that makes for a very compact, uh, easy to store, easy to transport trike. One of the other uh, updates that I've uh, neglected to mention there is it does have our new folding handlebars. Those were new for this year as well. Gary, also new for the Traveler, is the drivetrain. Uh, the Traveler will now feature the Enviolo uh, drivetrain, and I think that that simplicity of that uh, drivetrain is also going to make this trike uh, easy to use, uh, both in its folding and its storage. That, along with the uh, folding handlebars, this is really a really, really nice uh, uh, folding trike, and the retail on the Traveler is $22.99. Now, the next category uh, is something that uh, Teratrike's been known for for a long time, and I have seen a number of these out there. They're amazing. It is your tandems. Tell us about what you have in the tandem lineup. Yeah, so all these categories, I've kind of, you know, described what the category is is about, whether it's, uh, you know, the leisure or whether it's, you know, folding is kind of self-describing. And, well, <laughs> tandem's kind of self-describing as, as well. Uh, both of our tandems have been around for a number of, of years now. So uh, we have the Rover tandem at uh, 2,900 and the Tandem Pro at 7,700. Um, the Tandem Pro and the Rover, though, are really, really quite different animals. Uh, the Rover is a high tensile uh, steel frame uh, with direct steering and features, again, the MVOLO uh, City drivetrain, whereas the Tandem Pro is a made in the USA chromoly frame, it features the SNS couplers for ease of uh, breaking it down, both for transportation uh, and for storage. And that happens right behind the, uh, the captain seat. And it features a 30 speed drivetrain. So quite different animals, but wow, have we seen a real uptick in uh, tandem sales this year. So again, that category tends to be very, very popular with uh, recumbent trike riders. Okay, so let's move along to the next category, and it's a big one, something that has really transformed the triking industry, I'm sure you will agree. It's electric assist. Marshall, tell us uh, what you guys are doing with electric assist these days. Well, yeah, and I'll, I'll lead with this. Um, man, e-assist has simply exploded in the uh, cycling industry and the recumbent industry. It's unbelievable what that category has done. It's become what I would say very normal, if you will, over the last couple of years. It does a lot of wonderful things. Uh, it allows people to ride further maybe than they ever thought they could. Um, it allows them to ride maybe when they didn't think they were going to be able to. And certainly uh, one of the things you and I have talked about, it levels the playing field. It allows people that might feel a little bit left out because they weren't able to keep up with somebody else and, and now they can. So it's a very exciting category. And it's one that we're pretty excited about, not only from the fact that we were the first ones to bring a complete e-trike to the uh, recumbent market, uh, but it's one that we continue to improve upon year after year. So there's going to be things that uh, I'm not going to talk about right now, but I think that, Gary, I would say you and I will be talking about new ESS products uh, throughout 2021. So I'm going to go right down what we have at this time. 
And two of the products are quite similar. We offer the Rover Boost system and the Boost system. And these are really uh, quite the, the same uh, product. It enables people to add e-assist uh, to their existing terror trikes that don't have e-assist. Um, and the only real difference in them is the, the Rover has a square boom to fit the Rovers and the uh, Boost Kit has a round boom on it, which fits uh, the majority of the products that we have out and some of our uh, legacy products uh, as well. Uh, the Boost Kits feature uh, the Bosch Active Line Plus motor, uh, a 400 watt hour battery, and the Purion display. And I would add the Purion display uh, enables people to ride in several different levels of assist. Uh, in eco mode, we're finding that people are riding as far as, uh, man, as far as 65 miles before they find that they need to charge their battery. And in full turbo mode, which is just as it sounds, it's pretty powerful, gives you a lot of assist. Uh, people are riding in excess of 40 miles. Uh, the price for the boost kits are $24.99. And what that then leads me into is our EVO, which is a trike model that already has the boost kit uh, pre-programmed for it, comes with the trike. And that has been an extremely popular trike over the last uh, three years now with the uh, Bosch system. Features all the exact same components as the uh, boost kit. It just comes on that purpose-built EVO uh, for e-assist. And the EVO retails at uh, $4,500, uh, Gary. How about folks who uh, want to get on the road and go a little farther, maybe more than uh, riding one day, maybe two, three days, maybe going across the country, maybe traveling uh, around the world? Uh, what about adventure touring type of category? What do you got there? This category really started about four years ago when uh, then labeled general manager is still with us, Mark Cruz, really dove into our accessory product and developed what was called the storage solution category of our bags. And then came, you know, a purpose-built rack to carry a lot of those storage solution bags. And then the next step was to come up with trikes that kind of fill in that category. So in that adventure tour category, we now have three trikes. And the first trike in that category is possibly the most adventurous, if you will, of those three, and that's the AT. Uh, the AT retails at $24.99. Uh, it gets the new wider frame that helps with both heel rub and with stability. It has wide, aggressive tires, 24-inch on all three corners. Uh, it has one of our highest seat heights in the lineup and was really designed and spec so that it can take you, I would say, wherever your adventure wants to take you. Next is the GT. The GT at 2099 was designed as a road paved touring trike. Features chromoly frame, 24 inch rear wheel for optimal uh, touring gearing, our comfort seat mesh. And it really was designed to take on our uh, low rider rack and all of its uh, bags in that uh, storage solution lineup. Um, and many of those bags you're going to see kind of featured, you know, throughout this segment, uh, just in some of the lifestyle shops, shots. Uh, lastly, we have the brand new, soon to arrive GTS. At $3,000, it's the ultimate trike for adventure touring. Features a lightweight 6,000 series aluminum frame, stiff aero profile rims, Shimano 105 20, uh, 22 speed uh, components, and also features our brand new sport touring seat. This is a two piece seat that pivots right above the shoulders and has an adjustable shoulder angle. Uh, this is designed this way so that you can ride all day long in comfort. And that kind of uh, rounds out the, the uh, adventure touring category. Yeah, and a great category, full of great trikes it is. Now, 
Let's uh, let's see what you've got in uh, a new category uh, for Terra Trike, and it's the performance uh, category. Now, there's a, a trike I know you're about to talk about. I saw at uh, CycleCon last year uh, a lot of a lot of hype on this one. Uh, tell us a little bit more about uh, the new performance category. Yeah, so the new performance category is a brand new trike that we call the Spider. Features the same components as what I mentioned on the uh, GTS, but one of the differences is it has a two-piece aluminum frame. The front of the frame is made out of a 6,000 series aluminum, making it a little bit more compliant. And then the rear portion of the frame is made out of 7,000 series aluminum, making it stiff for incredible energy transfer. It's a much lower to the ground uh, trike than what the GTS and the other adventure touring trikes are. Designed, you know, basically for speed. And speaking of speed, it also has aero profile uh, rims on it. Features that same adjustable seat that I mentioned on the GTS. And Gary, it's a trike that we're pretty excited about. Uh, I should say all those uh, things I just mentioned too, and at a price of $3,500. Okay, at this point, folks, I want to take a minute to thank our wonderful retail sponsors for Bent Expo. You can see them uh, all around uh, the screen right now. These guys are amazing. They do a wonderful job of uh, letting you know about uh, what's available in the world of uh, trikes and recumbent bikes as well. So please support the sponsors of Bent Expo. All right, Marshall, that is fantastic. Thank you so much for uh, for giving us that amazing rundown of all of Terra Trike uh, models, products, right down through all those different categories. Your line is incredible. Any final thoughts for us before we say goodbye? Gary, I think that really does kind of round out, yeah, very well where we're at this year for 2021. The things I would close with was, uh, yeah, remember next year's our 25th anniversary, so Watch for new uh, product colors and events. And uh, I would say on behalf of WizWheels, you know, the parent company, yeah, make sure you check out uh, Greenspeed, our sister company's uh, product review. Yeah, that's the, uh, that'll be another Bent Expo. We'll have uh, you guys uh, take a look at that. Uh, it's, uh, it's a great lineup as well. So I guess that'll do it for today. Marshall, thank you so much uh, for being with us on Bent Expo. So long. See you later.